Hello? Can anyone hear me? Hopefully you can. Um, I cannot hear the background music I tried to put on for OBS. Uh, it should be the chip tune that Seven made for me, the little farm tune, but I can't hear it, so I don't know if you all can hear it. Um, I wonder in what option screen I would have to go to in the ever so lovely OBS on properties, maybe? To tell it to, hey, let me listen to it too. Maybe it's on audio properties. Audio properties. Let puzzle listen to the cool music. It doesn't want to listen, you guys. Okay, well, hopefully you you can hear it. Uh, let's see who's around. Hey, Jiswa. Hey, Simon. So glad you could be here, guys. Seven! I can hear you and I can hear the music too. So, Seven Castle Force actually made this tune for my kids. Um, Tower Defense uh, Ducks vs. Geese pro project. So, it is warm and near and dear to my heart. Because uh, yeah, I made it for my kid and my kid really loves making games. And I thought I would put it on as sort of the background until I get other more official music. Uh, and I'm also trying to figure out how to get it to all work together. So, hopefully. Hi, Lipe. Lipe Lilikos. How are you doing today? Um, oh, I'll have to change permissions, or not permissions, but I'll have to make an, uh, Seven Castle Forest an artist on, on this. I can, I figured out how to do that a little bit, um, because I've got, I've got things to show, guys. Um, we do really love the tune so much. Headphones bug. We'll sit there and like just whistle the su whistle the tune, you know, while he's doing homework, and he doesn't even realize he's doing it. Um. <laughs> so let's see. How is everybody doing? My next video doesn't resume production until maybe Monday, Tuesday. So you're taking a break. Yeah, everybody's gonna have Thanksgiving activities probably some turkey or whatever you make um, I make a really really good Puerto Rican type turkey I've described this to a couple people so you're wondering how can you make a Puerto Rican turkey I'll tell you you get a regular turkey obviously you know and you get this stuff called sofrito and it's a base that we use for every kind of meat yeah you can have a lollipop um, it's a base that we use for every kind of meat, and then you chop up garlic and green peppers and uh, a lot of cilantro, a lot of cilantro, and some onions and some other stuff, and you flavor it, and you add like a big tub of butter, and you kind of microwave that till it's liquid, and you you combine the two and you have this liquid solution. Then you take the turkey and you put it in a bag and you cut all these little slits all along the turkey from the breast all the way down to like the rump area of the turkey, the turkey rump. And uh, then you take like the turkey baster and you suck up that stuff and you, you um, just basically put all of that buttery herb oniony, garlicky yumminess into the inside of the turkey basically with that and then you put it in the bag and then you cook it like that and it's moist and it's glorious and it tastes like Puerto Rico anyway sorry I don't know how I got on that anyway happy Thanksgiving for those who celebrate and uh, <laughs> let's see anybody else <gasps> Cola hi oh I'm so glad you came I'm gonna show off your emotes so I have another artist to show off um, and I have emotes. I have GG's that Cola made 
very cute. My little coqui, my frog, is um, the coqui is the national animal of Puerto Rico of the island. So he made me all these frogs saying hiya and GG and just like the regular little cookie sitting there, they're these teeny tiny cute little things and they make this crazy sound and I love them very much and they remind me of Puerto Rico. So, and then we've got some puzzle butter because sometimes I slip and fall in places and I have butter fingers, so therefore puzzle butter. Uh, or, you know, just it kind of sounds like it. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Life. Yeah, I I want to have this whole little thing like on my away screens to show uh, basically the culture that I'm trying to represent with the emotes and stuff. I have a couple of other art things that I was able to get. Simon made a traditional Taino, which is the native Amerindian that was on the island of Puerto Rico before Cristobal Colon came and like started killing off all my people. Um, but before all that, uh, we had a really, really cool native tribe that uh, were the Taino Indians and they were pacifists and they worshiped the sun and there's this beautiful sun um, symbol that's actually on the you know, a representation of the native uh, Thainuanan culture. And if you look at my puzzle better, like the puzzle that's coming through, uh, the necklace that I'm wearing is a representation of that sun uh, from this my culture. And then the little frog on top of my head is supposed to be a cookie too. So it's all in there. If you gotta, if you gotta puzzle it, you gotta look for it and, and puzzle it out. <laughs> yeah. So um, in in all the aspects, I think being a retro gamer who you know loves these old games, but also you know being kind of from an odd culture to be sitting here loving old games with you guys, I wanted to introduce a little bit of that into kind of what I bring to the table. I don't know. Does that make sense? <laughs> the pieces of the puzzle. But anyway, that's uh, the little shaking frogs are the uh, uh, native Amerindian representation of the Goki. And here's another one. Simon made these. Simon Ashed here. Very talented in the 3D modeling. Um, and he's got some other really cool things that he's working with me to try to help me out and those are all things Simon made and I've got some potential other music things on the in the works and you know everybody's being so kind that I don't really know what I'm doing <laughs> and you, know, you guys are showing support and subscribing and just I don't know um, being here with me and talking to me and chatting with me and all that stuff <laughs> <laughs> I'm not very talented for petty dabbler. <laughs> you are very talented. Um, but, yeah, very cool. Uh, so, without further ado, I pulled out uh, Shantae. And I have not played... I, it, so I just played Risky's Revenge. Uh, and so I have, like, a, a Shantae in my mind. Shantae in my, hopefully, what I'm... The buttons I'm pushing pushing all the buttons and I won't have to relearn everything right from scratch right I hope cross my fingers uh, I'm excited to see what new adventure comes last we found out she was human again so I don't even know how is it all gonna happen I'm very excited uh, I think I got OBS to behave and show me the new Shantae Pirate's Curse. And then if I do this, does everybody see the right things? Oh, I forgot to pop out chat. Okay, hold on, I gotta pop out chat. I got this. It's only been a week. I meant to come on way sooner, but life and the kids, I've had Pandos, my teenager, home three days this week, and it's vacation, so he'll have been home all week. He's got the, the migraine kicks sometimes when uh, 
when they come, they come in clusters. He has a hard time with that, so. ATV showing Shantae and the Pirate's Curse. Yep, that's the one. Chatty Chat. Oh, yes. Hopefully Chatty Chat has moved to the actual... I forgot that I named it that. You guys, you can help me come up with a better name than Chatty Chat. I know I'm very chatty, but... Uh, <laughs> Ah, uh, that should be something better. Oop, I messed that up. Okay. Oh, that one says gift me a subscription. I want to keep that. I'm just kidding. Um, I will fix that, I promise. I didn't even know what I'm doing there. But that'll be on another stream. As long as you can see the gameplay, I'm going to call that a win. Because this is the first time I switched from one game to another like this. <laughs> That's the chat's meow. I like that. Puzzle chat. Puzzle chat sounds good. Like that. Uh, I like chatty chat. <laughs> I say things uh, around the house like socky walkies and eggy waggies. Oh, you're a parent. Oh, that's parent talk. I, I love that. I feel that so much. Like, why do we do that? <laughs> It feels ridiculous to say to other adults, but with the kids, you got to say it more than once. You got to get them into it. You got to like, got to rock that. Um, so I totally feel you, like. I feel weird saying like. People say like, like just to call you, like. It's not long enough. I, I want to be like, lipey or like dog. That's not going to work. That was worse. Um... I was about to ask, does that ever seep into conversation with other adults? 100%. 100%. You sound like a fool. You sound like a fool. And you can't help it. Only other adults who have kids will, will understand and not judge. <laughs> any young friends, any teenagers, my niece, she's just like, Auntie, Auntie, I can't be seen with you. <laughs> she doesn't get that bad, but... I mean, I started those kinds of things when I was first married, before I had the kids. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess you're just a special kind of guy, like. Um, I called my waffles, wafflies, and my wallet a wally. I'm a 28 year old, and I still do. Well, I say we're all a little weird, and I love it, and normal people, I cannot vibe with them and I do not understand that so I'm all about it uh, oh your oldest is 11 my youngest is 11 feeling like she'll be so embarrassed of me in a couple of years I know my youngest still loves me and thinks I'm like the coolest person in the world and then somewhere when they get into middle school a couple of years in and they get to that teenager they're just way too cool for you um, <laughs> it just happens and it's okay. It's bound to happen. Uh, gotta lurk for a bit, but have fun, folks. Okay, Seven. Oh. All right. All the love for this, uh, the beautiful music and all the stuff that you're doing. And enjoy your lurk. I loved seeing, I was, you know, while he's gone and lurking, I will uh, shout him out just a little bit and say he made some beautiful pieces that he shared on the Pixel Pond Discord and a few other places, um, and hopefully on his YouTube, of pieces that he made for his wife. And just, if you don't swoon when you like think about that story, you're, you're just not a person. I mean, it's, it's very, very sweet. We should all be so lucky. <clears throat> anyway. Alchemical, hi! Oh, you're using the cute frog emote! Yeah, hi, hi! I'm excited! Hi, Alchemical! I have not talked to you in a little while. We've been missing Tuesday Night Sci-Fi. Uh, we are covering Remington Steel with Pierce Brosnan. And he's like super slick, almost like a James Bond, but uh, more like a, a roguish type. And it's been fun, so... You should come join. All right. I've done enough just chat chatting. I've chatted for like 15 minutes without playing the game. I'm sorry, peeps. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get on to it. 
rats you go. Let's see what Shanti is up to. Oh, my Moobot thing. Sorry, one more interruption. Thank you. <laughs> hey there, lurkers. Thanks for stopping by. Only chat when you are comfy. I appreciate you. I totally told Moobot to do that, and I didn't know if it would, and it totally did. Uh, so I am learning all sorts of things. Emotes. And I have channel points, but it's going to be a 3D animation coming up of Puzzle Butter. And then things that you can turn it in for. And give me ideas of things to turn in for channel points. I have had every idea from like, paint my nails a special color and post it on Twitter to sing a song that I sing the kids as a lullaby. To, I don't know what, whatever you guys want to do. I wanted to make it last night, but I drifted off for a bit. Hey, no worries. I'm just saying we miss you, that's all. But uh, you do you. Of course. I can't wait to see you again there. And I'm happy you're here with us now. Alright. So, anyway. Channel points, all these things. All this catch-up stuff. I have things to say. Alright. <clears throat> Get the controller working, and... No, don't quit to desktop. Dang it! Um, hold on, apparently, there we go, apparently I'm just all, I gotta open up Shantae again, where'd Shantae go? I can do this guys, did it come back? came back, right? <laughs> Yay, I got it back. It's really fortunate that I pick a technology-based way to communicate with people because I'm just so... <sighs> so talented at that. Except for how I just closed it completely. All right. No, don't quit to the desktop. Why? Don't do it again. Don't do it again. What am I pressing? Don't do it. Dang it. <clears throat> Somebody needs to make me an emote that says dang it. Mommy, sorry, baby. Okay. One more time. Third time's a charm. I've heard that before. Just wait till I get to the actual gameplay. <clears throat> hey, Serial Arcade, what is up? I found out that you are Crash, and then it all made sense. So, what do you want to be called? Do you like to be called Serial Arcade now? Or can I still call you Crash? Because I look at that and I think Crash. Um, and you've, I've heard you've had like a thousand names or something. So, But you'll always be Crash to me. Uh, let's see. Hey, I pushed the right button this time. We are... We're on a roll. Hmm. <clears throat> Not a wizard. So many things. Crash is fine. It's one most people call me. Alright. Good stuff. The magic surrounding me has grown weak. Now it is time to invoke the curse. Hear me, loyal servants. A new source of evil. Whoops. Seize it, for your master has come to rise again. And take my place as the one true ruler of Sequin Land. Har, 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 har. Ren refuses to call you anything other than Crash. I feel that. Yes, I'm all about that. I'm with Ren. Gasp! I had that dream again. Oh, she looks so cute in pajamas. Ah, with the little bows. I want those. It's very adorable. They just went. They just went all out on the adorable. Um. All right, let's do this, people. Yawn. Oh, she's yawning. <clears throat> I 
guys just thinking they look comfy. They really do. I'm like, dude, that that's a way to chill. You would just chill and play video games like that. It's, yep. It's been the same one every night. So she's been having this dream every night with the uh, pirate's curse. Uh, oh, hold on one second. I'm good. Okay. Um, let's see. Imagine if they made merch based on that outfit. Uh, that, that, maybe. Hi, Retro Raider. How are you doing today? Glad you came on. Hope you're having a great day. Shantae can't be in normal genie attire forever. I... I suppose you're right. Now I want her in more outfits. Is that a thing? I feel like that's a thing. Somebody showed me like a ninja outfit or something the other day. Be right back. Offline Brad stuff. Brad stuff. Cola, I want pictures. I need to see all, all the pictures of all the Brad so that I can see like the Brad creation uh, evolution. Okay. <clears throat> back to the game. It's been the same one every night, ever since I became human. Yeah, we know you're human, girl. You still got your hair powers. Poor Shante. Oh, look at the little messiness in the hair. It's like me. Oh my gosh. Hmm. What in the world? Scuttletown is under attack. Oh no. All right, got to get serious. I may not be a genie, but it's still my duty to protect this town from evil. All right. Sky! <laughs> I can hear her name. Sky! Bobo! Is it another pirate attack? Worse, it's Ammo Baron. He's turning Scuttletown into a war zone here. An auto potion, just in case. Auto potion sounds good. Does that mean if I die, it just comes on? Because, uh, yes, please. You just got auto potion. It's time to put all your training to the test. Right, hey, fan art maybe? I bet you there is fan art. Um, my three-year-old says hi. Hi. Hi, three-year-old. Boy or girl? Boy or girl? That's Christine, Christina V. Oh, a girl. Aw. Oh, no, the voice. The voice of Christine. Yeah, that's her voice. That is true. Um, good morning, three-year-old. Cosplays are rich ima imagination. That's true. I did a little bit of a Shantae cosplay uh, around Halloween, and I posted it on Twitter. I did not put on any makeup, but it was interesting to have like a little piece of a costume type thing on. It was fun. Uh, so maybe we'll see more of that. I don't know. <laughs> hi, three-year-old girl. I say hi. <laughs> Pocket bot stealing. I need to sell. Seen a bikini Shante cosplay once or twice. That's what. Okay. Yeah. Cosplay's fun. It's a good thing. Oh, she's interested in pirates. Well, I'm going to show her pirates. No, I bought it on PSN app for my phone. All right. You're a human now. You got to fight like one. Take this pike ball and activate it from the inventory screen. I'm going to catch up with Sky. Okay, so I got a pike ball, and I got a auto potion. Bolo's right. I can do this without my genie magic. Probably. Everybody's running away. I get that. Hold on. Let's see if I can... What do I push to keep the get the pike ball? Alright, I think that just stays in. Alright. So I'm fighting these barren guys. Alright. My hearts are like in forts. Everything's kind of shaking.
Alright. Not too bad so far. Nice. Alright, here's this guy. Huzzah! Scuttle Town's Guardian Genie. Here to save the day. That's me. Mayor. Get real, Mayor. I can't fight the entire... Amorian army by myself? Do something about this. But you... But you see, I can't. I sold our town to Ammo Baron. In a moment of weakness, and then spent my money on cheap, waxy chocolates. And ate them. Say what? Then I had to go make dirty water, and by the time I got back... Dirty water? Really? I have no comment. I got back. He had already started to move in. He owns the town, so I can't make him leave. Boo hoo hoo. Yeah, we knew this story, but I mean, it's a good recap. You need plot exposition. So this is one way to get that. Uh, let's see. So we got... I love disco style in this version. And I love the disco style in this version of the music. Yeah, it's really hopping, right? You can just feel it makes the uh, the little motions she's got going. Makes it a little more hip. I heard pocket buy when you explained it made sense. Ah, uh, yeah. So, I can't get any more things, but I do really love seeing all the cool new things that are about. Uh, now that I, I can probably reach my keyboard. <laughs> Hi, everybody. <laughs> Hi, Alchemical. Uh, is he doing Super Mario Brothers Toad cosplay? 100%. 100%. He's like um, the kind of Toad that maybe somebody who doesn't like Toad might draw or see. He's, uh, he's not giving Toad a very good impression. It's just... So, and not everybody has to like Toad. It's okay. Uh, no worries. Yeah, he definitely, so I think that's explaining the first time, not that he did it again. Um, but I think it's a bit more plot exposition, because it was kind of like a quick plot point in the last one. So I can believe that they're just sort of establishing it. I'm a Toad supporter. I am too! That's why I think it's not fair. What are they doing to him? He used to be, you know, more, more hip and happening. Now I'm imagining Ammo Baron running the Mushroom Kingdom. You know, if he tried, look at this girl. She's not going to take it. Magic or no, I'm rat to go. Hey, that rhymes. That's pretty good. I'm feeling it. Ah, oh, dude. Who's that guy? Well, I guess I get his jewel. Let me wait for him to toss something. Dang it! He tosses in threes. Sometimes they toss in threes. Sometimes not so much. Ooh, can I get under this? Under this. That's the way to go. I'm not so good on the fast jumping, guys. I gotta get better. It's this thing. It's called Get Good. I gotta do that. Alright. Let's see. Yeah, you can talk, honey. Go ahead. Headphones book has a question. There's pots to the right of the I mean the left. Oh, there's some pots there? You're right. I could get those pots. Um, hold on one sec. Let's read some chat. I tend to play as Blue Toad in Mario games with my kids. Uh, I like to play as Toadette. Like if we're doing Mario Kart, right? What do you play as Headphones Bug when we play Mario Kart? I used to like PD Piranha, but I figured out it's actually better to use Toad because he's lighter. Oh, Toad is lighter, so it's actually better to use him for races? Good point. Alright, good insight, buddy. I made this one emote because Toad is greater than Bubsy. I can't see it fully. Uh, can you share it on one of the, 
this towards I need to see it in like a larger picture. Toad is great in the desert levels of Mario 2. He's, yeah, you got to play him right in Mario 2. It's a whole thing. So that can, we, that'll be an entire stream's worth of discussion. Toad in Mario 2 versus the other characters and how you should optimize Mario 2 for each level. Uh, he's like that one Arctic G.I. Joe that you can only bring under one very specific and particular mission. And other than that, they're not helpful. <laughs> I suppose. Some people can do all Toad uh, on Mario 2. I've, I've seen it done. Uh, headphones bug. Cola says hi. Crash says hi. Yeah. So you got, a, you got a few highs. Hello. <laughs> All right, you want to watch Mama? All right, uh, let's see. You know, I'm something of an emote maker myself, and I respectfully disagree. HD's Bubsy emote is a gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> well, you would know, Cola. You made my emote, so I, can, I cannot complain. I absolutely love them, and they're my favorite emotes ever. But... Crash does make a good point with the whole Toad is better than Bubsy. What is it? Can I say that number? Yeah, go ahead and say whatever you want, honey. Say the thing. Spice is on your chair, so you can't play Minecraft. That's why he's over here, guys. Spice is on his chair. And you know what the law is. Wherever the kitty sits, maybe you can entice him to play a different game. Go grab the feather or something and, and get him to get up. But he's napping on your chair and lounging on it. You know, Spice has doubled in size. We've had him for like a month and a half. And that cat, he started out as a kitten. He, he started like five months old. And he's like six and a half months old now. And he's just, he is a big boy. I don't know if it's a tabby thing, but he has ears like a bat. And he's just going to get bigger. Oh, see? You got it. All right. Headphones can play Minecraft. <laughs> hey, hybrid. Oh, how are you doing? Heart. I know. I always, whenever I see you in chat, I always think, I have, I always think of heart. I do, I'm doing it with my hands now, but you can't see it. Um, <laughs> Sad so did make the Bubsy emote for HD. He is biased. Uh, no, okay, but he messes with it and changes it all the time. I did. I do remember you saying that. So, all right, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Fun. Who wants to see more Shantae? Um, let's see that I miss. Oh, a, f a few more people said hi to you. Headphones bug, just one, alchemical. And Luigi or Peach in Mario 2. Yeah, I use Peach when I'm doing like a comfy type run. And I haven't even played it all the way through. But just whenever I do have it on and I put on Peach, it's like not easy mode. But <laughs> it's just, you know, it's, it's a, little, if, a little bit easier to know what you're doing. All right. I am enjoying Pirate's Curse for like the minute I've played and then like the 20 minutes I've chatted have also been fun. Um, everyone's being very patient with me and my silly chatness. Um, my wife walked through the door in the room and said, I love her voice about me. Oh, that's so sweet. Tell her thank you. I, I, I get a little paranoid about my voice because somebody once told me I sound like a cartoon squirrel and they couldn't hear my tone because my pitch was too high. I think they just didn't want to hear what I was saying, but it stuck. <laughs> so I always feel self-conscious about that. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you. Um, all right, let's continue. So far, the jumping, it feels like it's going to get worse because there's just there's a lot of chaos. So far, it feels like it feels very chaotic. Oh, come on. There's my little heart. Uh, so this one I just got a time. All right, not 
not too bad so far. But yeah, I really appreciate that. Oh, looks like there's something under here. Oh, I can get under. You posted the emote on Simon's Discord? Oh, thank you. Yeah, anybody who knows if you're, if you're looking for me, uh, find, you can find me on Pixel Pond or Simon's Discord are the two main places that I hang out uh, pretty much. And I love to hang out a couple other places. Like I was playing with uh, my buddy Mike just yesterday, last night after sci-fi. And we beat Streets of Rage 2 in one sitting. That was incredibly fun. Alright. These guys aren't too bad. Well, thank you, Crash. Ah, okay. Okay. He's aiming. Can I get him? I cannot. Okay. Ah! Okay. He's, is he going to be aiming all over the place? Okay. <clears throat> that was not my greatest voice. Ugh, I sound like a teenager in puberty. Um, so sorry. <laughs> okay, so if they're going to keep doing that, I have to like jump here and... No! Okay, I'm going to figure it out. Alright. I may have to be slightly quieter than... Okay, my normal... Chatty self. Okay. If I. I cannot get these guys at all, so I'm just gonna skip trying to get them. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh. Okay. Whew. Alrighty. What's this thing? Uh, it's stabbing me. Get away. Get away. I just did not want you to be under me. I did not think you were gonna go all stabbity. Oh, okay. Dude. With the stabbing. Okay. I got... There's just, there's, yeah, there's a lot of stabbing. Alright. Oh, GG's. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I should do more with it. Yes, you should do more with it. You're preaching to the choir. I'm the one telling you to do more with it all the time, Simon. Do more with it. Everybody go on Simon's Discord. Add. We'll all post stuff. Uh, I'm going to post my china on there. I'm going to post all sorts of fun stuff on there. And it's going to be a kickin' Discord. Uh, we just need you guys, right? So, well, he does. <laughs> I will not take over, just because I don't want to start my own Discord. No, of course not. Um, Alright, let's see. Target practice? Yeah, seriously, I did not know how that was going to happen, how that was going to go down, and I couldn't even take the guys down, and then they started shooting everything that I was trying to jump over, and it was a whole thing. Anyway, sorry, got a little carried away. Um... You know, I have a weird urge to play Metal Slug X now. Ninjas now. Ninjas again. Ninjas again now. <laughs> Thank you for posting your uh, Discord link. Everyone should join. Join. This is not subliminal. That's just me saying that. All right. <laughs> Let's see. We got Sky. We got Bolo. I made it. GG's. Let's see. what. Oh, this pretty bird. What's the bird's name? Wrench, right? Wrench. Caw! Wrench says the ammo baron is just ahead. Good, because I've got a message for him. Straight from my hair to his derriere. <laughs> That's his bottom. <laughs> don't, don't whip his bottom with your butt. Don't whip his butt with your bottom. His, his butt with your hair? Yeah. Not that one either. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and work on those lines. That's right, Mama. Y que se no se hace. Alright. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't mean to hit the people running. I knew something was going after me. Yeah. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Ah. I'm glad I was ducking. Sometimes I duck by accident. When I, like, move over, it goes down. Hey, there's a place to save. That's my first save spot. Yes, please. Saving. Please do not turn off the power. Save complete. I really need more lives. I need, like, three different hearts. I probably missed a few vases over there. So this isn't going to go well. That's right. Tear down that preschool and convert it to a long-range cannon. Don't you dare. Oh, for shame. That's not cool, man. Uh, this guy's going down. <gasps> Just what joined. Yay. Very cool. Um, yep. Wrench. Part run. Part finch. A wrench. But it did the mechanical thing. And it looked, and she treated it like a wrench. So it's a pun. So, you know, cola. Get on that. Uh, whip, whip. Be good. Good thing the bird isn't named Flip. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? I <laughs> Just say something nice. <laughs> Um, gonna go have fun at leaders. Oh, we'll see you later, Jiswa. Thanks for stopping by. It's fun. I am gonna play a little bit. Let's get this boss going. I think it's, I'm, I'm assuming he's a boss, but like one of those first early game bossy things. I first played this on Wii U. Which version are you playing? So it's the GOG version. Um, oh, okay. Simon told you. Yep. So I got it from him, uh, and it was super cheap, as I recall, uh, but I didn't pay for it, so. <laughs> All right, anyway, let's fight this dude. And that retirement center, another cannon. Dude, uh, it's really coming along. Sniff. I'm tearing it up here. Okay, yeah, his derriere is definitely going to meet my hair. Hold it right there, Ammo Baron. No one weaponizes the elderly on my watch. <laughs> I mean, that's one way to put it. Kablamo! Boys, you shouldn't have. Is she here to dance at my victory party? Oh, no, you didn't. You guys can't see my arms crossed. He's getting it. Thrice approved. Yes, she will indeed do. The nerve. What do I look like anyway? I don't know. Some kind of dancer, I guess. Aren't you? Oh, well, yeah. Yeah? Yes, whatever. Stop working our town. According to the fair... I feel a lot of kinship to Shantae. She's, I feel like maybe she's me a little bit. Oversized Chocoholic Landowners Act. Mayor Scuttlebutt has 30 days to refund the full amount of cash or edible confections before you can claim legal occupancy. Huh. Let me see here. Yeah, she's gads. Ye gads. Ye, is ye gads a word? Ye gads. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to weaponize the elderly, I suppose... You could find a more creative way to do it, but let's not weaponize the elderly at all, people. Ye gads, she's right, but I'm not about to let some purple-haired pipsqueak. Who are you calling a pipsqueak? Stand between me and my glorious new empire. Boosh wa, let's dance. Oh, oh, we're going to dance. Can I get you from where? Where can I get you from? Oh, you're going to run me over. Okay. 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 I'm gonna flip this at you. Uh, I'm gonna hit you. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I cannot take those bombs, though. Dude. I gotta jump over those. Okay. I could have come over here and hit you. Oh, I'm bad at this. You guys, I might not make it. Uh, 
Ah. Uh. Oh, I have one auto potion. I guess that saved my butt. My dear ear, as she would call it. Hit you, hit you. Dang it, I didn't even hit him once. Alright, I'm getting it. Oh, come on. Alright. I pressed the jump button, I promise. Alright, I think I got the idea of what to do. I just don't know if I can accomplish it. I have one heart left. He got me, guys. Ugh. Oh, he got me. Yeah, I gotta retry. Yes, honey, I saw him laughing too. It sounded like the sound of laughing. My my, my peanut gallery over here is telling me he sound he he heard uh he heard the guy laughing at me. Alright. Let's get this guy. Come on. You're waiting for your items to smelt? Okay. Alright. I got it this time. Watch me take no damage. Probably not. Ping. Alright, one more time, guys. Hey, I jumped one. There we go. <laughs> Yay, neat. <laughs> Aw, thank you, guys. Thank you. Boss, I got it. GG's, yay, all my GG frogs. That takes care of you. No, look what you've done to my tank. It was a gift from my mother. Oh no. What's all this commotion? It's the ammo baron. He's trying to destroy Scuttletown. I want my chocolate back. Halt. Well, sounds official. Who said that? Oh, I know those guys. I beat two of those guys in that uh, ammo baron tower from the second dungeon in Risky's Revenge. Uh, let's see. My 11-year-old daughter <laughs> says, Hi, 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 hi. Aw, hi, hi. Headphones Bug says, Hi to you, too. <laughs> He's 11, too, and loves watching Mom game. Yep, it's an 11-year-old girl saying hi to you. Don't blush. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, it's great to, uh, to pick on 11-year-olds. The way you <laughs> beat that was downright rad-ish. Oh, well. Alright, well, let's look at these guys. Uh, I do recognize them from there, so I don't think they're going to bring me good news because they worked for him. What? It's the Royal Guards. They'll fix this. Yeah, no, dude. Guardian Genie, you must cease and desist your attack by order of Secret Land Sultana. What? Me? Fa ha, you see. The law's on my side, girly girl. Uh, hello, 11 year old kid and Kakua Cola. <laughs> Cola got the special treatment. 
Wow, that's adorable. Yeah. But, but he's the one who, for assaulting the rightful owner of this town, your status as town guardian is hereby revoked. You got a court summons. Don't worry, it's only a bill. <laughs> Sorry. I just got zoomed back into I'm only a bill from like 1980 something in my head. What's this? You are hereby confined to quarters until your hearing at Sequinland Palace. You will be relieved of any special weaponry at that time. She doesn't she doesn't have any special I mean she has the pikes. And she has her hair. Looks like someone's getting a haircut. Ah <gasps> no. They can't take my hair, can they, Uncle? It's all I have left. Dito. Do as they say for now. But what if... Patience. I will head to the palace myself and sort this out. Okay, Uncle's got me. Just promise me you'll stay out of trouble. Whoops. See those yellow words, stay out of trouble? Don't think that's in Shante's dictionary. I promise, Uncle. My poor, poor town. Dude, it's all your fault. Guess we blew it, huh? What a mess. Your uncle's right. We just have to place our trust in the authorities and hope for the best. Mm-hmm. Wait up! Sigh. How did I get into this mess? You need a nice warm bath. That's what you need. That rotten, risky boots. Ever since she stole my magic, things have gone from bad to worse. Sigh. A hot bath is just the thing I need to clear my head. Exactly. Dude. All game sprites should listen to me. Oh, look how cute with the bubbles. That's adorable. I don't own a bathtub. Uh-oh. Don't tell me. It's risky. It's risky, you guys. Well, well, isn't this a sight? Risky boots. Oh, I love that look on her face. I'm going to take a quick picture of this so that I can use it as a reference to draw her later. Because uh, with the bubbles and that look on her face. Yep. Alright. Sorry to interrupt for that quick pic. Very cool. Um... So here's Risky Boots. Funny how she has... Let me see. Retro Reader says... Funny how she has that item pose with a smile, even when it's something bad. Relieved of any special weaponry, they will cut her hair. That's what they said they're going to do. They're going to cut her hair. Um, and Cola says, narrator's voice, and it was at that point that Shanti realized that perhaps her fists would make better weapons than her hair. <laughs> No, her hair always makes a better weapon. It is Risky Boots. Risky Boots reminds me of the Gross Star Sisters from Proud Family, especially with this music. I do not know that one. Uh, Retro Raider. Hmm. The Gross Sisters from the Proud Family. I'll have to look that up. I have to say, this is the first time I've seen a mimic bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta throw a good Pokemon joke. In the flesh. Enjoying my booby trap bathtub, I see. It's a booby trap. Arg, you're in big trouble when I get out of this. Please, you're giving me goosebumps. 
I'll keep this quick. Do you want to do her part? Alright. Alright. You do. Headphones Bug is going to do uh, Risky's part. That way we have two voices. Huh? What are you talking about? My men and, and my weapons are gone. Who else but you would take them? Me? <laughs> That's okay, Puffy. You're the only thief around here. Really? Then perhaps you can explain how your uncle has my crewmen caged up in his lab. Don't be ridiculous. Okay then, I'll prove that you're no good. That you're up to no good. That you're up to no good. Aha. Uh -huh. I, I didn't know, but I'm sure there's a reasonable explanation. I know the reason. You wanted revenge for that incident with the Cheney Lab. Just look at my poor defenseless anchor rat. He's terrified. He doesn't look very terrified. Looks fine to me. that noise. Alright, good job, buddy. I know, something's happening. We're gonna see. What, what's gonna happen to this guy? Christina V actually does both Shantae and Risky Boots. Ah! I was looking over at the chat and I didn't see this giant bat creature. Yeah. Scree! A cackle bat! A what? No. No, it can't be. What happened to him? I'll explain later. Look out. I'm unarmed. Deal with this creature quickly. Ugh. At least let me get decent first. My hair hasn't gotten cut yet. Ah. Alright. There we go. It is. It's a creature. Uh, Proud Family was a Disney Channel cartoon. Oh, maybe that's why I missed it. I, I saw up to a certain point when my kids were watching this. So. Lipos. This is the first time you've recognized a mimic bathtub? <laughs> you've recognized... Sorry, I didn't put the emphasis on the wrong, I right think spot. I know what happened to that tinker man or whatever. Someone corrupted him with that stuff. He corrupted him with that stuff? Hold Y to suck things up. There, I'm gonna suck it up. You got dark magic. I got him now. Could you please explain what's going on here? There's no time. What about the lamp? Aren't you going to try to take it back? Keep it. I've got bigger fish to fry. And so do you. If the pirate master has you to see when what? What was that about? Who's the pirate master? Hmm. hmm. It's a whole thing! 
Aw, oh, poor bat. Really, you're going to say, aw, oh, poor bat, but let me tell you how to kill an elephant? Sorry, I just saw that and thought of that. Um, yay, thank you guys for helping me start this off. What a fun adventure so far. Let me find a place to save. And, oh, I guess uh, I'll talk to people a little bit. Well, what do you want? You're off the hook. So get lost. <laughs> this pirate master guy, he sounds pretty dangerous. Dangerous? He was the greatest threat Sequin Land has ever known. The last time he showed up, it took the combined power of every last genie to defeat him. Wait, you're talking about real genies? They captured him? He's dead, but don't let that fool you. With the genies gone, the pirate master will do everything he can to regain his dark magic and rise again. Dark magic? The stuff that transformed my crewman back there. The pirate master must be stopped, or Sequin Land is history. After all, he's no right to destroy what I've worked so hard to conquer. Well, maybe I can help. Ha! A runt like you wouldn't stand a chance against a foe like the Pirate Master. I can deal with this myself. How? You couldn't even fight a single cackle bat on your own. True, but if I destroy the dark magic at its source, I won't have to fight at all. Cutting off the power he feeds on should keep him in the grave where he belongs. I'm only lacking one thing. A map of the Forbidden Isles. That's easy. Just try the library over at Sequinland Palace. I can't go to the palace. They'll clamp me in irons. Unless... Hey, don't look at me. Those guys want to clip off my monster whipper. My monster whipper? She calls it a monster whipper. Fun adventures for the win, says Crash. Nicola says, if it makes you feel any better, you can kill a person by feeding them 132 pounds of garlic. I don't think somebody could eat that much garlic in that amount of time in order to get the toxic dose of... What's in garlic? Magnesium? Selenium? Something? Yes. It's a monster whipper. Everybody's got to have a good monster whipper. Uh, I used to be a chemist, guys. I should actually know what's poisonous in garlic. It's embarrassing. Um, then, <laughs> then I guess I'm on my own. But I might reconsider my position if you fetch me that map. It's your choice. I feel like I don't have a choice here. But uh, yeah, there you go. So let's see if I can save and buy things and all that stuff, do all the things, and then make my kids lunch who have so patiently been waiting longer than usual to, uh, to get their lunch. Woman over there looks just like the nefarious pirate Risky Boots, well minus the hat. She could be anybody. Got any items in your inventory? Highlight them for a description. Then use them whenever you see fit. Whee! Hmm. It's over. Oh. I got dark magic again. Okay. I'm trying to go around to town. Oh, I found a squid heart. I don't know what a squid heart is, but it looks adorable. All right, no, I should probably 
go into town more. Find a way to go into town more before I go and get myself lost. Hey, sweetheart. Okay. Mwah. I know. I know. Mwah. Okay. I'll be right there. I'll be right there. Do you want to start with a snack? Why don't you grab a yogurt and I'll be right there. Alright, I'm going to save and then I'll I'll say bye to friends, okay? Okay. Um, let's see. Selenium. Yes, I guessed it on my second try. Um, someone ate enough garlic around 132 pounds. There would be enough selenium to poison said person. I don't know why I was so happy to hear that. I, 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 I feel a little bit like a bad person there. Um, so, you know, that makes me think of an old joke from one of the Muppet movies. A girl sees Kermit sitting at the park bench and says, Hey, look, Dad, a bear. Her father replies, No, honey, it's a frog. Bears wear hats. Bears wear hats. It's a frog. Bears wear hats. Muppets take Manhattan. Great Muppet caper? No, it's in Muppets take Manhattan. Anyway, that is a good joke. Uh, dark magic. Yay. Yeah, I got a little dark magic there. Um, if squid tarts are anything like the rest of the squid, they're delicious when stir-fried. You're probably not wrong. Uh, my son likes, like, galmare, so, um, and that's, that's a little tentacly. Oh, there's another little squid heart. Let's see, what do I got here? Scuttle Squid Smith at your service. I take adorable little squid hearts and, a uh, Melt? Melt them? <laughs> Melt them down to make something more healthy for you. Oh my god. I don't know if I want to do this. Who said this game was a good idea for me? You know I'm tender hearted. Oh my gosh. No, I don't. How many? I'm going to have to pick these up. How many do I need? Do I need to combine like two of them? Oh, I'm going to have to ask her again. <laughs> oh my gosh. Sorry, sweetie, but it takes four heart swiths to forge a heart holder. <laughs> oh no. There's an achievement for not using the squid smith. <laughs> At least in the Steam version, not the GOG. Gotcha. If squid hearts are anything like, yep, they're delicious. Oh, it's Pirate Queen. Risky puts on her hat. It's risky, Pirate Queen. I mean, basically, yes. You can't tell that Superman is Superman, right? Without his uh, glasses. Takes takes the glasses off and all of a sudden he's... Hey, I never got to this part in the other one. Take a dip in this herbal spring. It's sure to restore your vigor. Wait, for real? Ah... Uh, Hype. Very cool. So I can come back to town if I'm really uh, having a, I don't want to say sucky moment, I'm having a, uh, hey, what's up, friend? Shante, I thought they had you under lock and key. Hmm. I'm on my way to the palace library to get something to read. Do you know how to, you know, to pass the time? Can I borrow your library card? You read a book? This I have to see. You got library card. Hey, reading books is awesome. Reading books is awesome, baby. Um, just don't ruin this card like you did the last one. I nibble when I'm nervous. <gasps> Me too. I I'm a nibbler. Shante. I feel her so much in all the ways. And the, uh, so, okay, we got the library card from our friend. So that was a thing. Mayor sold our stuff. I know, I know. Mayor's a bum. Let's see who's in here. Oh, the guy with the bouncing chest. We definitely got to see the guy with the bouncing chest before we go. Potion. Pirate flare. Pike ball. Super pike ball. Bubble. So all of these things are not, like, I don't just get it once. 
Learn Backdash. I never use that very well. Learn Recover. Silky Cream. Oh, I definitely want that. Can I just use it? How do I get the, the Silky Cream? Did I not buy it? I didn't buy it. Okay, I did the thing where I don't buy it. Upgrade your hair to deal more damage. Faster whipping. Can I get both? Why does it not let me do it? Did I hit the wrong button again? <sighs> it's not a skill issue that stopped me from getting this game. It was pushing the wrong buttons. Yeah, you can have this. There you go. Alright, anything else? I don't have enough cash for silky cream. Okay. And just get a uh, a couple potions here. Just in case. Alright, there we go. We'll find a safe spot. We'll end it for today. We'll at least have gotten to... Oh, it's a picture of the old man. Now I can see it. I just wasn't paying attention to the little pictures that tell me what the shops are. Alright, here we go. We're 80. Yay! Agent R. There's an achievement for not using the squid smith. Uh, I am not really um, good enough, I don't think, to get through without those extra things. I feel like that would be hard mode. Oh, it's not on the DOG version anyway. Okay. It is odd that my brain automatically added the voice of LeVar Burton saying, <laughs> but you don't have to take my word for it at the end of reading books are awesome. I loved reading Rainbow. That was like, that was my jam. I loved reading at that time. I had to convince my kid that libraries were cool and and he's like a good learner and everything, but kids are not all about libraries. And once we got in there and started looking at all the things, we found a book on cats and getting a kitten. We found a book on scratch coding. But it's like they don't even know what's in there. It's a whole thing. I will discuss it with you, Cola, if you want, because I have I have opinions. I always have opinions. All right, saved, and we can get on out of here. If I press exit game. I did that well and then I don't have music to this part but at the very least it's uh, it's a thing all right my peoples thank you so much for hanging out and chilling with me and uh, starting Shante Pirate's Curse it's been super fun. I love that they're continuing the story. It's in the same town. We got the same people. Similar bad guys. I wonder what they're going to do with everybody. Risky isn't uh, quite as bad. She's not the villain here. So, you know, uh, very cool. Take care of you too. Off to a great start. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Okay. Thanks for the stream puzzle. Cool stream. See you later. Oh, bye everybody. Okay. Uh, it's been fun. See you puzzle. Oh, bye Retorator. Thank you guys all for coming. Let's see who I'm going to raid to. Who do you guys want to raid? Let's see. Uh, we could raid Games Mistress. Uh, she is... Oh, she's doing just chatting. Let's see. Somebody's got to be doing retro. You might just go to Junkyard Dave. Start that raid. Hop on in there. Looks like I see Roadrunner and Wily Coyote. So I don't know if we can go wrong. Bye, Crash. Bye, Seven Cola. Bye, Simon. Thanks, everybody.